There are a couple modern ways to make your written articles more readable, like adding a key takeaway section, frequently asked questions at the end of the article, adding quotes, images, maybe video links, skinny paragraphs, where these giant blocks of text are split up into sentences. You see a lot of the latest blogs using this style. But how do you create these types of articles at scale? How do you write hundreds of them, maybe even thousands of them, about each of your well-researched keywords? Sure, you can use ChatGPT. You can do something like, write me an article about finding the best running shoes, provide an FAQ, key takeaways, and relevant links. So ChatGPT would write this, maybe even turn this prompt into a custom GPT. But still, you have to copy this text and manually paste it into your website, format it properly, but that takes time. Let me show you guys a tool that does all of this for you automatically and more. Let's get right into it. If you're new to this channel, welcome. I'm Wes GPT, and this is a web app that I am building live on this channel. You're going to head on over to youraiagent.com, enter a name, email address, password, re-enter your password, and then click sign up. It's going to drop you onto the settings page where you're gonna to wanna to connect your website platform to your AI agent. For SEO AI generated articles, you're gonna to wanna to use either a blogger website, your ghost.org website, medium.com profile, Shopify store, Webflow website, wordpress.com or wordpress.org. In this video, we are going to connect a common wordpress.org website. Let's click on this tab. And I have two ways to connect a WordPress.org website. You can do it via the custom plugin. If you're curious how I made this plugin, I made it with ChatGPT. There is a video on my channel that talks through the process. It's pretty neat if you're interested in those type of things. Or you can use an application password. In this video, we're going to use the application password. So let's head on over to our WordPress.org dashboard so we can input some settings. All right, here I am on the wordpress.org dashboard. And there's one thing I need you guys to do or to check that the setting is correct. So hover over settings, click permalinks. The permalink structure needs to be something other than plain. I recommend post name. It's also the best for SEO because your keyword or title will be in the URL. So select post name, save your changes, now we need four things. So first, name your connection within your AI agent. I'm gonna call it Wes Frank website. Now we need a website URL. And from the WordPress dashboard, I like to grab the top part of the URL here. So do not grab HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash. Just grab the URL. So for me, it's westfrank.com and paste it into this input box. Now we need a username and app password. So I'm going to users, add new user. For the username, I'll write Wes Frank. For the email address, I'll do my email address, heywestfrank at gmail.com. And for the role, it needs to be editor. Now click add new user. On the newly created user page, scroll all the way down to the bottom and under new application password name, you can type whatever here. Click this button and we're gonna copy this password, copy paste it into the app password. My username was Wes Frank. Now I can click connect. And if everything's correct, you're going to get a notification that says your wordpress.org website is connected. Let's click OK. Over in my post page, I see this testing the WordPress API. You can delete this. OK, back on my settings page, I see my new connection right here. It is a wordpress.org connection. I can remove it at any point or rename it. Now you'll go to subscription. And if you don't have an active subscription, this button will say subscribe. You can click on this. It goes to a secured Stripe checkout page. And once subscribed and it's a success, you can now go to the home page where you see a bunch of options for AI agents. Youraiagent.com is building a business suite of agents that work on your behalf for your company. We have Reddit bots, LinkedIn bots, 
AI email support, Amazon affiliate product posting, Twitter or Xbot agents, posting to Tumblr, automatic YouTube comment responders, and we're adding more of these agents each week. But for this video, and because you clicked into it, you wanna learn how to generate hundreds of SEO optimized articles at scale. And for that, we're gonna use the auto blogging agent. So let's click on this. Now, in order to set up this agent to run automatically, it's gonna need a few inputs. First, choose your connection from the drop down box above. By default, I have my westfrankwordpress.org website selected. Now under content scheduling, how often do you want this AI agent to post? Let's say we want to post every six hours and we can start it immediately. We want our post to be published right away. You can uncheck this if you wanna send it to draft. Now for content preferences, we need to input a tone or style. Let's do professional, the target audience. This will depend on your business. Let's pretend I'm targeting gamers. I write gamers right here. And for the language, I'm gonna write English. Now, do we want an FAQ section at the end of our articles? Yes, I do. So I'm gonna to toggle this on. And do I want my paragraph split up into sentences to follow that modern blogging style? That is called skinny paragraphs. And for this example, yes, I do as well. Now for the AI generated images, how do I want them to look? Let's go modern and I'm gonna go bright and vibrant. Now here is the keyword list. You can also input a list of article titles, but for keywords, you can do your own research and then copy and paste them all into this input box. Make sure you separate them by a comma or you can start typing them manually. So let's go how to win at Fortnite. And I'm just confirming that's how Fortnite is spelled. You can tell how much of a gamer I am. How about how to win at chess? The best characters in League of Legends, the top Super Nintendo games of all time. You can write as many keywords as you like. We limit it at 500. And the AI agent is gonna write an article centered around each of these keywords. So if you input 500 keywords, by the end of this workflow, it would have generated 500 articles. Next, we're gonna choose the article length. We have short, standard, medium, long, or extra long. Now, extra long is not always better. To rank high on Google for your targeted keyword, there are hundreds of different factors and time on page and readability are a few of them. So if your article is too long, especially for that specific keyword, your article is gonna be ranked lower. So you're gonna to have to play around with this and find out which length works best for your niche. In this example, let's just go standard. Now we can enter some section links. So at the end of each article section, we can hyperlink to a video, to a specific page on our website, to an affiliate product, to an outside URL, whatever you prefer. And for example, let's say I want to hyperlink to the ESPN eSports website. I type this URL in here and for the link text, I'd write check out the latest news on eSports. So this text, this sentence is gonna be hyperlinked to this URL. Next we have boilerplate text. This appears at the bottom of each generated article. Again, you can add video links, specific text, maybe your social links, talk about your company, your business, your website, anything that you want your visitors and your readers to know, and it's gonna be included on each of your articles. So I give you a rich text input. You can design it to your heart's desire. For this example, I'm gonna leave it blank. Next, under hyperlinks, are there other specific words in your articles that you want hyperlinked to different pages? And the example I give here is if I write AI agents in the text input box and I link it to youraiagent.com, every time AI agent appears in the text, we're gonna get this hyperlink. Next, we have labels. So there are a few things hard coded into our structured outputs. And this ensures that we get properly formatted article text each time and for each possible website that you can connect but we need to cement certain labels. So I'm cementing two types of labels in these articles. We have the key takeaway section, and if you enable it, the frequently asked questions. Now you can change this text 
let's say instead you want to call this FAQs or key takeaways instead, major talking points, but make sure the text here properly conveys the text below it. This part is also good for different languages. Let's say I was writing in German. You would copy this text here, paste it into the label, and then if you choose German for your language, your entire article will be in that language. Last but not least is the categories and tags. So for WordPress.org, we pull the categories and tags that you have created on your website. So here I am on WordPress.org. I can go to the category section and let's call this one video games. We're going to add new category and for tags, let's do something like Super Nintendo. This just helps organize the articles on your website better. So now I can find these in the categories and tag section and I can attach them to all the articles that I have created. So finally, I'm going to click start agent and it will take me to the workflows page where I can see all of my actively running agents. Right now I only have one and I'm running this auto blogging agent. I can cancel this at any point or I can click the info button and edit this workflow. So I can change the connection, can change the posting interval. I can change content preferences, image preferences, add or remove keywords, change the article length, edit the section links, the boiler text, hyperlinks, labels, or add some categories and tags. On our WordPress dashboard, we see the newest article right here. I'm going to click on view. We got a nice look in video game image. Looks like Fortnite mastering victory, the ultimate tips on how to win at Fortnite every time. We have the skinny paragraphs. We have an image down here, major talking points instead of key takeaways. Here's a bullet point list. We have paragraph one, paragraph two. Remember our hyperlinks. Check out the latest news on esports. And it goes to those websites. And we have another image. And this is relevant to this subheading. It looks to be about creating the perfect, relaxing video gaming environment. And then we have the FAQs at the bottom. How important is my mindset in winning Fortnite matches? Having the right mindset is critical. Stay positive, be adaptable to changing situations, and learn from your mistakes. Avoid tilt by taking breaks when needed. If you want to generate hundreds of SEO optimized articles for yourself using the auto blogging agent, I'll leave a link to youraiagent.com in the description below. If you want to build your own custom AI agents and maybe turn it into a web app or a profitable business, check out the online course, how to build a custom AI app. I'll leave a link to this in the description as well. And if you like this video, I put two more on the screen right now. Both have been catered to your personal YouTube watch history. Give one of them a click for me, give it a watch, and I'll see you in there later.